Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I'm going to be doing an updated hair routine or hair straightening routine from natural to straight. Yes. So I just wanted to kind of quickly go over what I do in the shower. I just shampoo and condition. I'll put some conditioner in my hair um, and then take a shower, kind of leave it in there. And then I'll brush out my, or not brush, but I'll use a white tooth comb to brush out my hair. So my hair is naturally like a tight curl, um, but I just haven't really dove into like my natural hair like I should, you know, like I would like to. So I don't really know like what it is like. It's, it's not to his, his full potential, let's just say that. But um, yeah, so I'll do that and then I'll just brush out my hair. Um, when you guys see the video or see the part of the video where I'm about to blow dry my hair, you can kind of see like what my curl pattern is. Um, but I already combed it out, so it's not like quite what it is. It just kind of looks like a mess, honestly. But yeah, so I'll shampoo condition and then I'll leave it in a towel like this. For about 30 minutes to an hour just depends I try to do it when it's like su uh, subtle like a little bit damp but not completely dry because it'll be hard to um, blow dry at that point but I don't like to blow dry my hair when it's super super wet it just it's harder for me to get it super straight like blow it out as straight as I can so yeah so after I do that I'll blow dry or I'll mist it with some Garnier for cheese um, with a heat protectant, let's just say heat protectant. And um, then I'll go to town blow drying and the blow dryer that I use is called the Yellow Bird. I've had this for years. I've had it since I was a freshman in college. Uh, my grandma who does my hair like professionally, she's always used it. She gave me one when I graduated. Um, and the straightener that I use is the Chi. It's like old, I've had it since I was a freshman in college. And it hasn't done me done me wrong um, and then I'll just do that and I think that's about it I'll have everything linked down below that I use um, so yeah without further ado let's get into the video I want to apologize for the noise in the background I'm not gonna be talking that much so excuse it um, but I let my roots dry before I go in with a straightener and after I blow it blew out my hair I put the macadamia natural oil healing oil treatment on my ends there we go so yeah it looks like that and 
I will have every all of the products mentioned linked down below. I'll also have my shampoo and conditioner that I use linked down below. Um, I also put this heat protectant. I think I showed you guys earlier, but it's just a Garnier Fructis flat iron perfector straightening mist. I always section off my hair. Sometimes I'll do half, which I think I'm gonna do today. Sometimes I'll just go in and like this, but um, we'll see what I do. All right, let's do this. Finished half. Now I'm gonna go on to the 
other side that took about 26 so on to the next nearing the end of this so if you guys haven't noticed I when I I've done it like half and I've straightened like halfway that makes sense on each side um, and that's because when I'm done I want to I'll flip it over it's like I'll have more volume on the side that I like have my my hair parted so I'm gonna do this last piece This is probably like the most painless hair straightening I've ever done. Usually I'm just like, oh my gosh. But I think I'm gonna start for sure doing it this way more often. And I'm just gonna part my hair one more time. I'm gonna use my wide tooth comb. I don't even know where this is from, but I'll link a, a comb like this and my hair and a hairbrush and a small tooth comb. In the description that's similar. I'm just gonna go back and straighten where I didn't get the roots quite good enough. Okay. Make sure there's no more bumps in my hair. Um, I don't really have like a part per se, like what side like I prefer. I just kind of flip it over. I don't really care. And that's it guys. Um, that took me all together probably, probably an hour and a half to complete from blow drying and to this finished product. And I usually don't put anything on afterwards because I've already put some oil like on my ends. So it's usually pretty good. Um, I don't like to put too much product in my hair, even when I get out of the shower because it weighs down my hair like a lot and my hair will get all stringy and gross and just like not cute. So I usually just put like a little, little, little bit of oil on my ends like I told you before. Um, and then my hair is good to go for the most part. So yeah, that's basically all. And I'll, sometimes I'll bring it over to the side. I really don't prefer like have a preference, it's just how it kind of falls. and what I'm feeling at the moment. But yeah, guys, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll have everything that I used or similar to what I used in the description box. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. <laughs>